this video is just a quick update for you on our softwood cuttings taken from our Argoranthemum Jamaica Primrose last spring 2020. It's now spring 2021. They were out all summer. We have them in containers. They were taken in for the autumn. And coming up, John's going to show you what he did next. Hello, welcome to John Horsey Horticulture. John's been teaching horticulture professionally for over 30 years now. And on this channel, we're hoping to help you develop your gardening skills. Whether you're new to gardening and would like some tips on propagation or some pest control or growing some vegetables, or whether you're a seasoned haughty who could always use some tips and advice. If you like learning those things, do consider following us. There's no charge, just push the subscribe button. If you push the all important notification bell, that lets you know every time we upload a new video. Morning everybody. If you remember last year we took um, some what we call uh, softwood cuttings of Argoranthemums. Uh, this is Jamaica Primrose, uh, yellow daisy like flower and uh, they rooted quite well. We grew them on, um, they were left in pots all through the summer and they were a lovely show. Now back in the autumn I pulled them in here because uh, they, well, they don't like the frost too much and the winter we'd have had it would have killed them off anyway. So they've been allowed to grow on here, they're just, just, just above freezing um, uh, and now of course they've really got very overgrown, they're a bit of a, bit of a mess, they're not going to be suitable for this year. So I'm going to take some more cuttings and start off new plants. The old plants really aren't worth keeping but what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut these back very tight to the bottom. <laughs> if they should shoot out, that would be fantastic. If not, I'll have plenty of others to do to replace them with. But it's a plant I really love. It, uh, it's, I do like yellow anyway. Um, but it, it also keeps going all, all through the season. And you put them in, I put a few in a pot and you've got instant uh, interest there all through the year. All through the summer, I should say, sorry. What I'm going to do is just take these back very, very far. I mean, they may shoot out again, not really very likely. It's far better to take more cutting. So going back to the base, you can see here, all oh, rubbish in there. There's the base of the plant. OK, and I'm just going to cut it back like that. There, there, tidy that up. Now I'll leave that to see whether it'll grow. I don't think it will, but um, I've got loads of cuttings here. That's the main thing. Okay, so now we've, these are the cuttings back, and there's the little flower, that's what it will be like. And I'll pop that in the water later on. But I'm just going to go through and look for some nice cuttings. And if I take that off there, you see, I just pull those bottom leaves off. And I'll come along and, 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 and tidy them up properly in a minute or two. But just for the moment, just so I've got, some, got the cuttings ready, down below a node, there's my little cuttings ready to go. And you remember we did all that last time. A uh, nice little shoot, about two or three inches long. Um, if, a, if possible, without a bud on it. And they, we know they'll root really nice and easily, so... Um, that one, I won't bother with that, because that's, you see, it's got a, a flower which probably got a bit cold and it stopped flowering. I've got a tiny shoot out the side, but that's not, that's... I'm not desperate for cutting this. Nice lot of uh, fresh new growth coming. Just chop off there. Of course, I'll go and tidy these up with the knife before I put them in into, into compost. The good thing about leaving them in there all winter, they, they, they've um, grown away and made nice cuttings. That will do, that's enough for what I need. Okay. Well, I'm sure you spotted John didn't pop them on in that video. He did do it after we stopped filming. Three weeks later, they have come on an absolute treat. In the meantime, thanks ever so much for joining us. We very much enjoyed having you. Until next time.